Richard, Head of Trading here at CTR. And I just want to give you a quick rundown on, um, on how I see the markets at the moment. Uh, it's been an interesting couple of days that could be um, the start of something bigger that's about to happen. The last two or three months, um, it's all been about selling the dollar across the board uh, against the euro, against sterling, uh, Australian dollar, Kiwi, the Canada, um, yen, Swiss. That's all been the way of it. All the banks were saying sell dollars and, and we've had a decent move. Um, I think a lot of people expected 2021 to, to continue the same way. But over the last few days, we've had some interesting moves, especially in uh, the Aussie against the dollar, New Zealand against the dollar and dollar CAD. Um, we've had a decent rally in the dollar against those three pairs and all of them now are a good 200 points away from the dollar lows and it looks like there's plenty more room there um, to continue that pattern these pairs seem to be a little bit ahead of the game for now for some reason um, and you've got dollar swiss euro dollar and cable sterling dollar are moving that way but not quite as quick but then pairs are all approaching key levels where they could catch up and, and accelerate. Um, 120 euro dollar is always going to be a psychological level. It was a massive level on the way up. If we can get close to that, there will be a lot of stop losses just below that level. Um, and the market could magnet towards, towards a break of 120. Um, dollar Swiss. 89 20 30 level has topped out about 10 times we're close to it now if it breaks through it could be some stop losses there could be a chance for a couple of hundred points on the upside um, which will push the euro dollar 120 level into uh, into into play um, and and cable sterling dollar um, people have been you know Brexit's out of the way, be long as sterling, make money, easy. Obviously things are never as quite as simple as that. Um, the market is long. The market is long of sterling, clearly. The market is really short of dollars. And if everyone's short of dollars, it usually does one thing. And, uh, and we'll, sooner or later we'll reverse. Um, so I think there's opportunities here that... that um, Keep an eye on the Aussie, the Kiwi, the CAD. They seem to be leading the show a little bit at the moment. If they keep going, they will push the real majors, um, Euro, Sterling, um, Swiss and Yen, into play. And once they break key levels, um, the whole, everything moves together. Don't forget that. Don't just stare at your one pair. Anyway, just my thoughts for the day and uh, safe trading. Cheers.